what am I missing out on? Right? We're doing an episode on PGRs. Yeah. I've never used them. Am I really missing out? If you're wanting to push a crop and you're truly wanting to manage a crop tanner, I believe that these hormones have a fit in operations. Guys, understand how to use them. When I talk about farming, I think about farming in five different phases. There's that foundation phase that is combined to planter. There's the seedling, the establishment phase, which is getting that crop up and getting it going. There's an opportunity for plant growth hormones there with GF acid and IBA and kinetin. There's also that the next phase is that architecture phase, and that's about building that plant structure, building the bigger, fatter, wider leaves to be able to create a solar panel and also build a fuel tank to, to hold and store nutrients so that when we get to the next phase into reproduction, that we can manage that reproductive plant health. And then there's the maturity phase. But those other four phases, especially those middle three, that's where we can use PGRs or hormones to our benefit. We can get that crop established. We can develop a factory that's going to help it metabolize and use nutrients efficiency. And then we can retain yield potential at the end of season. 